One of the things that I'm looking forward to over the coming years in the field of obesity medicine is the development of new therapeutic agents for the management of obesity as a chronic disease. We know right now that the two medications that are available that are GLP-1 receptor agonists, semaglutide and terzepatide, both have what are considered maintenance doses available. And these are the dosages that patients ideally would achieve by an up titration schedule and then working with their physician can be determined which of these doses is the best long-term dose for them to continue on. I think that being able to have these maintenance doses is very important because we know that each person is going to have a different response to these medications. Some patients may lose a good bit of weight on a lower dose and other patients may need to escalate all the way to the highest dose before they're really achieving meaningful weight loss. So having these off ramps for patients to you know, get off of that escalation schedule and maintain their dose is important. With semaglutide, we know that the two approved maintenance doses are the 1.7 milligram dose and the 2.4 milligram dose. For terzepatide, the approved maintenance doses are 5 milligrams, 10 milligrams, and 15 milligrams. For patients that are considering using the lower doses of these medications, I think it's very important if the plan is to use just a lower dose and then to discontinue therapy without achieving a maintenance dose and without being again maintained on a maintenance dose, it's really important for these individuals to consider other options for weight loss. Again, we know that the risk of weight regain when stopping these medications is high, even if you are utilizing a lower dose. So again, I'm hopeful over time as more options hit the market, there will be medications that are going to hit that sweet spot for patients where they'll be able to take the lowest effective amount of medication needed to be able to maintain the weight that they ideally need to lose.